have to put like 63 plus 50. Jasmine Jenkins' living room is doubling as a classroom these days. This is a multiplication and division word problem. A far cry from her regular nine to five as a nursing assistant. Mm -hmm. Now she's doling out paperwork of a different kind. So she can learn how to count money. An unexpected assignment that's forcing her to shift gears and put on a teacher's hat. To write it over there. Handing out worksheets to her third and fourth grade children to complete when they're supposed to be in school. Missing weeks now because the school district withdrew them from Pinchbeck Elementary. Um, I have paperwork from the Henrico Residency Office. Jenkins showed us this letter the Henrico County School System sent last month, informing her they don't believe she lives in this house on Blue Jay Lane. But the children's great grandmother says she watches them walk to and from the bus stop almost daily. When they come home, I be standing at the door because I know what time the bus come. No time the bus come in the morning, so, so we be ready. Jenkins is adamant she lives there with her children, grandmother, and her mom, whose name is on the lease. Yeah, yeah. She says the school district told her a tip came in questioning her residency, and investigators looked into it. I asked who, and she said it doesn't matter. Just know that they said you didn't live at their address. And I said, well, apparently they went to the wrong house. Jenkins says she gave several documents to verify her residency. I took my refund verification. I had my driver's license. My mom brought her lease. I have bank statements with my address on it. Jenkins received this letter from the school district noting that her story was inconsistent and investigators only spotted the children near the home one time. Read a book. And her kids have now missed three weeks of school and she hasn't been told where her children should be going or where school officials think she lives. But what happens if he misses his SOLs? Does he fail for the whole grade or, you know, she's missing school as well. Does she fail? third grade. The mom says she has no idea where to turn next. Problem solvers reached out to the Henrico County School District. A spokesperson said for privacy reasons, they are unable to comment specifically on a student or a family situation. But he says when a tip comes in, they will thoroughly investigate. They will also allow a parent to prove their residency during a review period. And then a final decision is made. After that, there is no appeal. Working for you on the West End, Shelby Brown, CBS 6 News.